happening in Buffalo. E! News senior correspondent and Buffalo native Ken Baker is back in Buffalo today. He's promoting his new book and movie based on his personal life. News 4's Angela Christoforos joins us now live with Ken Baker in the studio to tell us about his story. Angela? Christy, many of you may recognize Ken Baker from E! News. He's been reporting Hollywood and celebrity news there for about 10 years. And who knew that he's from Hamburg? So great to have you here with us That's in great. Western New York. Great to be here. So happy to have you. Yeah. So you're here promoting your book and movie. It's yeah. called The Late Bloomer. Yeah. And it's actually it's based on a true story, something that happened to you in your life. Tell us about how that really shaped your life. Yeah, I mean, I had just a horrific <laughs> brain tumor. And I know it's interesting. You know, we, they made a movie out of it. And it's a comedy. It's a brain tumor comedy. I know that sounds kind of counterintuitive, but it actually is funny. Um, but the memoir I wrote was really about my battle with this tumor. It depleted me of testosterone. I just had so many physical problems. And it was a real struggle. But I got healthy, changed my life. And uh, the movie kind of focuses on that transformation. and. Uh, uh, yeah, so I, I got to come back to Buffalo, and I'm here uh, for the weekend, and I can't wait for Saturday night. We're going to do a nice premiere. Now, it's amazing that you went through most of your 20s not even knowing you had this tumor. You yeah. didn't find out until you were 27. Yeah, it was horrible. Uh, <laughs> sounds like a great uh, basis for a comedy, huh? Uh, no, it was really rough. And uh, But, you know, I learned so much about myself and what it means to be a man. And uh, just by having this kind of male issue, by not having the normal hormones and stuff. And so, for me, it's all a blessing. I, I mean, I'm so lucky. I'm, so, I'm here on Channel 4. Love with it. you, I'm the luckiest guy in Buffalo right now. Come on, let's face it. So, um, I have no complaints for me, and it's been a, a great career for me in Hollywood, and it's uh, it's it's great to come back home. Now, I know that you had your movie premiere in L.A. last month, but we all know that home is where the heart is. So yeah. it has to be so exciting for you to be back in your hometown promoting your book and movie. Yeah, so, yeah, we're going to have a big uh, Buffalo premiere. Um, we're going to call it the New York premiere. This is like a big, this is the, the New York premiere of this uh, movie is going to be uh, 4.30 on, uh, at North Park Theater on Saturday, and it's going to be really cool. And, um, yeah, I mean, get friends and family. You're coming, right? Of course I'm coming. Wait, I'm bringing so, the crew. Oh, the crew's coming. <laughs> She's coming. So if you don't come, you're going to miss out on her. Who cares it's about, not me? about me? It's about you. No, I don't. I don't. Is this leopard print? Is this leopard print or yes, what's this called? It okay, is leopard print. Leopard print. I can't wear a leopard print. And she can wear leopard print. I think you need to go see her in person. No, I'm just kidding. Um, it's going to be a fun night, obviously, and I hope everyone can come out. Now, you left Buffalo in the 90s, so that's yeah. a long time ago. Buffalo has really come Are you along. saying I'm old? No, I'm not saying that. That's a long time ago, Ken. <laughs> well, what I'm saying is that <laughs> Buffalo has really grown, and it's come a long way since then. Every time you come home, you must notice that it, it's kind of like a new Buffalo. What are your thoughts on the city's growth? Uh, my daughter's here. She spent the day at Nichols School today, and uh, we were driving. Uh, we sit down at Harbor Center. Beautiful. The Marriott. Gorgeous. The view of Canal Side is so amazing. That did not exist when I was growing up here. We were driving down Elm Street. We're heading down to the uh, to, uh, over to uh, the Skajakuda. I can say it. I'm local. I can say Skajakuda. And I said, Chloe, when I was your age, we wouldn't come down here. <laughs> we, were, we were afraid to come down here. It's so nice and uh, refurbished and renovated. I'm so proud of being from Buffalo, and I'm so proud of what the city's been able to do. And Buffalo is proud of you, Ken. Oh, thank you, Buffalo. So don't miss his movie <laughs> premiere. It's this Saturday at 4.30 at North Park Theater. More information on how to get tickets is on the Founded on 4 section of WIVB.com. Thanks again for joining us, thank Ken. Thank you. Christy, back to you. <laughs> Angela, Ken, thank you so much. And Ken, thanks so much for, for being here today.